All right, folks, here we go. It's the Harman Hydroflex 60 pellet boiler. Um, it's my second attempt. I got my flu straightened out. Got a new cap. Used the right silicone, and uh, she seems to be holding nice and tight. Um, inside there, there was a uh, fillet weld that wasn't ground down. From the factory, they ground down this outside, but they didn't grind down the inside of the pipe where the sleeve goes into, so I had to grind that down, make it flat. But uh, other than that, she's working great now. I'm using Ventus, three inch pellet pipe, double walled. And uh, right now, she's uh, holding steady at 180. Those are my settings. Running at three and a half right now. 180 for the max, 172 for the min. She's burning good. And we got the overheat loop over here. Comes down, comes out of this thing. Turns on the uh, pump and goes over here to my radiators. So I haven't had to use them because the house makes so much demand that it never comes on. But it's good to have. And then I got the uh, bulk storage feeder, which is going to be a pain in the neck to set up. <laughs> so, but uh, I did it all yesterday with 24 hours running, and it used three bags. And I'm using these hardwood green supreme pellets that I got from Home Depot. And uh, that was. 219 a ton for those. So they seem to be working fine. Probably gonna burn whatever cheapest stuff I can find. So you're gonna have to clean this thing every day anyway just to scrape the burn pot and fill it up. So, Never mind. Alright. Let me have any comments you guys got. That's the Harmon. Hydroflex 60.